I'm saying to myself, oh my God, how are these people surviving? How are they surviving? Um, like in New York right now, uh, and they're saying that it's going to get worse. It's going to get colder. You know what I mean? And that's why I always emphasize, like when you have family are foreign and them send money come gear or them send things come gear, don't waste it. Appreciate it. Because the weather conditions and the elements that they have to deal with and go through, it is really traumatic. And so it's cold over there right now. So the bomb cyclone uh, developed overnight. Um, this occurs when low pressure, uh, when a low pressure system has a significant rapid drop in atmospheric pressure that spells wind gusts as strong as 80 miles per hour along the coast. Now, a meteorologist on CNN, uh, Dave Henman, said it's basically like enduring a weak hurricane except getting blasted by snow instead of rain. It is being predicted that New York City and Philadelphia will plummet to three degrees degrees this weekend. Boston will plunge to seven degrees below zero plus up to a foot of snow and my heart goes out to Rowan and listen me my heart goes out to everybody in New York right now, everybody along the East Coast, all the persons affected. Because, Kelly Kwan, these are the things, may I tell you, you know, at Jamaica, we take so many things for granted. We have beautiful weather, bad to bad. We have little rain, and, you know, our sun might be very hot, but that's basically it. I, watch, I watched something on CNN where it looked like some big balls of snow was falling. It's like a freezer. Like, I saw a fireman, his helmet was frozen. I mean, I said, no, Father God, I can go so, no, this can't be a ball, ball of blow or some lime in your pocket. Because how is it that your helmet, Calico, is frozen, cars are frozen, and I'm just, just watching the news, I am cold. Just reading the stories, I'm cold. And I'm saying my heart goes out to them right now. So everybody who is overseas working hard, uh, you know, to make a better life, you're over there right now. You know what I mean? My heart goes out to you because, and I send you like a warm, fluffy hug right now. Oh my God. You know, I'm sending you lots of warmth. Oh my goodness. And I just hope and that people will be safe. Sun. Yeah, and some sun. <laughs> and 13 persons have already died, um, Calico. Yeah. 13 persons have already died. This is my him no my love. One criminal him car. He might be criminal. He a criminal. Him in a Pennsylvania, my love. Him run through a red light while he was on parole um, in an attempt to elude police after causing a four-car crash. But instead, his frozen body was found in nearby bushes. <laughs> I wonder if I read it. Adam's right. I report for here. Nearby in bushes. nearby bushes. <laughs> My God, he was on parole after pleading guilty to a 2012 fatal hit and run and fled, uh, fled the scene of the accident. Uh, he ran from police and in my eye, in a 18 degrees out there. No, sir, really? I <laughs> waited to go up. He never watched Titanic. No. The, he had never heard of Titanic. Some, some, <laughs> right? Can you hear it? I, like, I'm like, okay, but then again, you know, some people say maybe it's karma. Maybe, you know, hey, that's how it goes. So the cookie crumbles, you know what I mean? So, karma gave him a high five. I'm telling you, yep. the one big high five. Karma. Or, or cock up, no, karma cock up a ten for him, Ed. You understand? <laughs> so, <laughs> cock up is a ten tips is out. <laughs> you know? But, um, you know, I'm, when I'm looking at what's going on, uh, you know, we we have so much, uh, you know, wonderful weather. Weather. As, as we spoke about yesterday, Calico, we have fruits, we have food, we have everything at our disposal. Because as you can imagine, in that kind of weather, nothing grows, everything is ice. It's like one big fridge. You're in a, you get a med lid, and Calico, people still have to go to work. People still have to send their children to school, still have to function in all of that. And, you know, I'm just wanting everybody uh, to be careful. Uh, please, um, you know, operate with caution and... Um, um, I wish you guys all the protection and the guidance. Keep yourselves warm, uh, be protected, and just go and open your eye and look out at your eye then. Because really and truly, mm -hmm. I, I, I don't have grudge oh no, at this psychological moment. I've seen where there are, have been airlines, uh, some airlines have canceled flights because uh, they just can't fly. It's unsafe to do so. It's unsafe to land and that kind of thing. So this weather um, is really having a negative effect uh, on all uh, you know, of us. So I just hope that everybody will remain safe. Uh, Karen says her son is in Minnesota. Uh, so 
you know, I hope that everybody will be safe and, uh, you know, all the persons who are there freezing in Canada, like Morgan Rich, I wish you all the best. And it's, Eleanor says it's cold in Philadelphia, so all my Philly massive, big up on yourself and please remain warm and remain safe. But we have great music for you. And of course, I have a great interview coming for you right here on Miss Kitty Live. It is January 4, 2018, temperature 30 degrees Celsius in Jamaica, land we love, the land of wood and water and Miss Kitty Live. JN International Money Transfer. Safe, convenient, affordable. The time by JN Money Transfer is 316 on Nationwide 90 FM. Pepper Seed Thursday, indeed! Good afternoon to you if you're just tuning in. Thank you for making the smart choice and the smart switch and always keeping your fluffy diva in the mix. Gotta say good afternoon to all those locked and loaded on my Facebook Live. I just heard from Jennifer Salmon that JFK is closed right now. And by the way, people, yeah, it's Salmon, not Salmon, okay? I've heard, you ever heard somebody say that? Yeah, I'm like, many times. Times. Almond. La, or almond. I, you know, at that almond. point when you're saying almond, I just want to like take I out your trachea, it. okay? I cannot manage <laughs> it at all. I cannot manage, okay? So, guys, it's almond and it's salmon, okay? So, just to, and it's St. Thomas, not Thomas, okay? Just a little, you know. I'm not Thompson, but Thompson, okay? It's right, great, fabulous, you know. Right, great, fabulous. <laughs> no, what do you hear the things that Michaela call? Where the editing that see somebody like somebody comment part touch a picture such as something and then say resignate with her. What? It's resignate with her. <laughs> you know, I you know, I'm just wanna send her you know. It's resonated with her, you know, but she put resignate. I was like, you know. You mean like, oh, your fantasy food? I'm a fantasy food. I got to tell you. And the worst part, I want the man to look here, and I use them words here, and I said him something here. Like, what man, I look me, and text me, say, him love with all his heart and soul, and put S-O-L-E. You know, I want to run up and down for the phone, and I want to just crab it out, because, oh, him like what I wear on Magnum, and spell the wear now, no? Where? Where? W H E R E. You know, you know, what a black fit and stretch out and bring them out to take all my body. Why, sir? Like, God, to God, no three times. You want, sir? You like what I wear. Really? You did? <laughs> oh, really? Yes. What about your first year in English? Come across and dark. Is that right? Yes. Yeah, so, you know, just a little language 411 today. <laughs> right there. So, big ups to, oh, Nantucket. Oh, my God, Boston. Oh, Lord, Karen. Oh, my Boston massive. Good afternoon to you. And, of course, if you want to watch me live uh, in my studio, all you have to do is find me on Facebook at facebook.com slash the fluffy diva and by the way i'm wearing my saint kitts shirt today you know my kitticians hi how you doing i did a show in saint kitts uh, sometime last year had a ball had a blast so big up to thug babe and all my kitticians and you know i'm miss kitty so you know you're my kitticians and i love you guys so uh, my guest is here and uh when i see you know um men like this or a man i should say <laughs> you know like this in my studio i am very elated and the shaggy and friends show this saturday to be held on the lawns of jamaica house uh we'll see them on stage and i know that many of you have not seen him perform uh, in a number of years and he is bringing his very signature voice uh, the Velvet Mellifluous voice uh, to the stage and I'm so happy and honored to have him in my studio right now because you know when you talk about toolbox you have the spanai night yeah. you have the screwdriver and you know but very important everybody have, have a pliers at home can we do not have a pliers oh, yeah, there's man. a lot of things you can't do <laughs> his name is everton bonner but he is more popularly known as pliers and he is my very special guest here on miss kitty live one half of the duo is missing but of course uh you know he's here uh to represent for the other half, players, good afternoon and welcome to Miss Kitty Live. Well, big up yourself, Miss Kitty. You don't know. It's a pleasure to be here with you. Miss lovely, Kitty. lovely. Thanks for Every being time. here. Yeah. Uh, thanks to, uh, you know, thank you uh, for coming in today. Um, when you normally, you know, growing up, uh, I remember Murder She Wrote. That was a big thing. Mm -hmm. That was a big deal. Uh, yep. That song opened so many doors. And I mean, that was back in 1993, mm -hmm. produced by Sly and Robbie. Big up to Sly and Robbie. Every you time, know what I mean? Every time. I slide him or not getting all. No. Yeah, slide about family around 
I may go feast and I may go feast, right? And that song, I mean, when your album came out, Tease Me, mm. it was a big deal. And I mean, you blew up the charts. And the name Shakademus and Pliers uh, was of worldwide acclaim. Exactly. But before you became Pliers, let's go back to your Rock Hall days, you know what I mean? Yes. Growing up in Rock Hall. Yeah, the original part. Yeah, <laughs> the original <laughs> part. What was that like for you? Um, it was very good, nice experience. Um, coming up through life, you know, uh, we never, we never rich. Yes. Come from poor family, so we, you know, we, we, we learn the craft. Yes. Through earth, through mm -hmm. life. Yeah. Um. Nice family. We used to love my family, love my mother, love my father. Cause we grow with a mother and a father. And nice. Them stay with me. They never leave us. Nice. They, you know, work to help us. I mean, even though they never have it that much, mm -hmm. but at least they, they did their best. Then give with the love. Yes. And um, it was hard, but we we push through. Yes. Yeah. Cause we decide say yo, me have to establish myself, you know, to the world, you know. Yes. Sit down and never talk much. Very quiet. Yeah, you're a shy guy. Well, I mean, I know. <laughs> <laughs> kind of, yeah, no, you know, I, I, around the corner, not really extroverted. Yeah, used to, but them things are kind of drift. Yeah. No, when you're a superstar, no one them big chain and them something, you can't fly again. <laughs> ever. And I look up at the camera. Yeah, that's that. Yeah. So, I mean, you know, the experience when I have was very great. Yes. Good for me as a youth at that time yes. come up to be a man right now. It, it was good. <clears throat> Tell me some of the values that your parents instilled in you from that age, growing up in Rock Hall, that have helped to guide you into the man that you are now. Well, we learn to work. Yes. You know, every man you used to have to get up and sweep the yard mm -hmm. and get the, the firewood, you know, to, 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 to cook the pot mm -hmm. and them things you know, most of the time. Yeah. Yeah, and you know, I used to have to go look after the animals, them like the cow my father used to have and all of that. So. Yes. What was your father's name? Um, Ivan O'Banna. Ivan O'Banna. Hey, yeah. can you hear them name there? And that may tell you about them back in the days, man, they know oh, Ivan O. Oh, yeah, that's what oh, I mean. Oh, no, look at Ricky. Yeah. I'll Damian. You understand? With the ear, my name is Ivan O. Oh, you know, say a strong man. You know, say when the man is licking it up. You catch all mom same time. Oh. Yeah, yeah. the pink eye now going to catch it. Oh, Mr. Man. Ivan O. What was your mom's name? Violet. Violet. All right, Miss Violet, pick up yourself. <laughs> so, Mr. Ivan O. Bonner and Miss Violet raised you guys. How many siblings did you have or do you have? All right, no, I have, um, well, 10. Hey, wow, okay. Mother of ten kids. Mm -hmm. And was singing a part, because I mean, you have brothers too, who are singers. Who are some of the, your famous brothers that a lot of people may not know? Yeah, you have uh, Spana Banner. Yes. Then you have Richie Spice. Yes. And Snatch. <laughs> <laughs> No, yeah. was it so? So when I when I say okay, so you have so many singers in your family. Mm -hmm. Was it something that you guys organized, or was it just by the way? Was your mama singer? Was your dad a singer, or was singing in your family? No, my, my, my mother used to just like singing at the yard when she had do her washing. Yes, and then thing there. Uh, my father, you know, never really heard him sing. Mm -hmm. But no, I mean, me just come up. In my life, when I come up as a kid, it's like we used to listen to a lot of Bob Marley mm -hmm. and Stevie Wonder, Lionel Richie, and the Commodores and them people. Yes. So I just grew up for myself, start loving music. Yeah. Toots and the metal and them. Yes. Until I decide, say, I love it, I just feel the love. Yeah. And I start, like, <coughs> find myself a write, like, put a little pen to paper and write, look at things, them, and look at lyrics. And yes. You know, when I realize uh, something was serious inside of me, I decide to say, yo, my, my, Yeah, pursue it. My, yeah, go through it. Yeah. You know? Which school did you attend? Rock Hall All Age. You know? mm -hmm. mm -hmm. Rock Hall All Age, and yeah, then... That's right, yeah. And then you came, uh, and then you said, okay, I'm going to take this music thing seriously, and this is where my passion lies, and may I got to just run with it and work with it. Yeah, because, um, look, uh, I mean, if you tell it, it's like, well, I really have no... Because my father don't, don't even know his side of family. Yes. So whenever I come to see the whole family, we'll have said they are foreign and, mm -hmm. you know what I mean, we can't go so and whenever in politics, we get farm work ticket. Yes. So, you know, me look around as a, as, a, as a youth at the time and say, you know, say, I'm going to fight me. I'm going to fight me, you know. Yes. Where, you, wh wh where do you fall in among the ten? Um, 
the fifth. The fifth. All right, number five. Yes. Yeah, mm -hmm. yeah, true. And um, me just decide say I forget something. I have to build up my family. More want something for you know build up my family out of this. Me could see if we can make some more money out of yes. life and be more. In a society, because it's like in them time, they when you really, when the poor people look down for you, uh, away. Yes. You know, we still have friends who usually thief and go there and take this and take that and rob this and rob that. And I watch them one, one dead and one, one and thing and just say, yo, music. Because mm -hmm. I want my mother proud, you know, as somebody. Yes. You know, so I decide to say, positive. Well, I'm part positive pliers in my studio this afternoon, ladies and gentlemen, boys and girls. He will be performing on Shaggy and Friends. He is my very special guest on Miss Kitty Live on a pepper seed Thursday, taking you down memory lane back in the good old days and rekindling those nostalgic memories. Many persons will hear the hits, they will see the glitz and the glam, but we're taking it back to the source, back to the root, and show where all of it is coming from. So, when did you get the first break, or who first? First recorded players. Ah, uh, first RG. Mm -hmm. uh, um, go RG one day and I do some audition. Audition day was Thursday. Mm -hmm. And then time we have like a um, hundred youths come for audition. So, I uh, do an audition and I'm seeing a uh, murder she wrote. Mm -hmm. And then put me on side and I said, alright, you stand up over there. Because I said, I must send out a lot of youth, but yes. when I said, stand up over there, I realized, look at him like this song and they record me. Yes. And, um, and where was the studio? That, 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 <coughs> already, that close to uh, around the stadium, the, remember, Mountain, around the view the, yeah, Mountain View side. Mountain View side, yeah. Yeah, I'm going in the evening after everybody leave, the youths, them leave out and thing, them put me in the yard. You know, it was about three of us left. They put me in the advice in box and I just go one shot and shot murder she wrote. Yes. And do a song named True Love is Sweeter Than a Candy. Yes. Too bad true. Yes. And then start, never would have started. <laughs> <laughs> what was it like when you first heard your song on the radio? Where were you? Can you remember where you were? And what were the thoughts? I was at home. It was like floating like a butterfly. Nice. Sweet vibe. Yes. Nice energy kitty. May I tell you? But before it, it reached that, still, you know, me have a long, hard um, life before me reached the say, you know. Because mm -hmm. me used to walk go town, me, me used to go town, like, leave from Rock and go town. Yes. Most of the time when me reach home at night time, me used to walk from our Reddings Road, enough night to go Rock Hall, you know. Wow, from Reddings Road to Rock Hall? Yeah, sometimes. Me used to on, when me used to there on George Pine, me used to leave me at Hillfoot. Wow. Gas station, I'm walk, go home. To Rock Hall? Yeah, in the wow. night. Sometimes I reach home at 4.30 in the morning, 4 o'clock. <laughs> you see me? So. Wow. I see my mother, and enough of the time, I see my mother screeching through the room. I come like she not asleep because she had checked me dead. Yes, yes. <clears throat> Sorry. And, um, but, a whole heap of hard work, me do. It's not like no way, you know, you can't just go on the, 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 the laptop and make a ready man sing. But yes. It's, it's rough. You have to be the genuine article yeah, at that time. Definitely. We're talking to Pliers. He's telling us his story. And that is why I like to get people's story. Because a lot of times people see your glory and they don't know your story. Sure. They see your life and they don't know your sacrifice. And that is what I tell people all the time. We live in a society now and a, and a culture now where it's a microwave mentality. Where mm -hmm. everybody wants it now, now, now. Yes, now, now, now. Yes, so you see Pliers upon the charts. And you see my fly. Yeah. And you see him upon the show them. And you want it now, now, now. It's a process. Anything worth having, anything worth attaining takes a process. And so we're going through the process with pliers here on Miss Kitchen. I'm going to take a break and we'll be right back. It is Pepper Seed Thursday. <laughs> Yeah, 
Two smile, three smile, she got me going wild. Book map, oh baby, don't change your style, sweet honey. No, no, no. Tease me, tease me, tease me, tease me, baby, until I lose control. Till I lose control, they call my body and soul. Oh, girl. Mad. Suddenly I think about the love that I was searching Chilling Well, I'll come back with them at 3.30 mm, Time signal? Period. Okay I'm Rushing Good. up those stairs before my lovely, favorite lovely. store closes Lovely, lovely Turned on That will put some pressure on it Good Supplier has talked to me about um, Shaggy and Friends <clears throat> Yeah, it was Shaggy and Friends now Shaggy, can't, you know it's five times them call me And we never get to do the show until Shaggy Call me one day, I was at home and Shaggy called me and said, Why players? <laughs> Every year them call and the boy the can't make it, I hope they make it this year, you know? Yes. But don't no, want to let me down and I say, oh yeah, say Shaggy, what do you mean? What do you mean? Nice. Nah, you know, up. Nice. Up for your ticket for your show, Shaggy, because you don't know. What you're doing is, is great. Yes. We don't love, love more people, all them kind of meditation there in Jamaica right now. For each other. Love and yes. It's the kids. Care you know? It's the kids. Some choice. poor people our don't can't even find the first dollar to give them kids. Yes. To eat. Yes. Seeing much more for care them a certain big hospital. Yes. Seeing I see them kids dying. So what you're doing, Shaggy, is excellent. Man. Great. It's perfectly great. What would you I like to say to your fans? See it? Our fans. Yo, we don't know me all these love with you. We just want to come out and come out and see me Saturday night and shaggy. Mad. Shaggy. shaggy and friends. Life. See? Every time. You don't know. It's for a good, you know, good thing. So come out and support. Nice. Andrika? You understand? That we are said to them. <laughs> all right. Are oh, you back already? Yeah, I'm back already. Turn it back now. Nanny FM, Miss Kitty, live in your ear wherever you are in the world. We've got you covered all day, every day. We have the best of the best on my show. Top quality, substance over hype, all day, every day. Kings and queens in my studio. And I have one such right now. Players in the studio. You know what I mean? Original, authentic Jamaican voice. One that is so familiar. And when you hear him, you know him. He will be performing this Saturday live with Shaka Dimas on Shaggy and Friends. But right now, he is in the chair and he is my very special guest on pepper seed thursday taking you down memory lane back in the good old days and rekindling those nostalgic memories so you grew up in rock hall you come yeah. to rg studio mm -hmm. you auditioned you were successful mm -hmm. and never will be picked up the song started, started playing yeah. it and your life changed no mm -hmm. i want to tell you so i never start the like, song then played. it's never that played and then maybe i think another one person this jacket did pick it up and start playing, but never really uh, reached nowhere at that time. Yes. The song Murder She Wrote in, in the Caribbean make a little impact on the Caribbean. I mean, say, oh, this song I go on nice in the Caribbean country, then, but I mean, that was that, and that wasn't it. Yeah. I still have to run up and down and I walk up and down all over the place. I walk from Rock Hall, I walk growing up, um, Middlebrook Estate, go check Yellow Man. Yes. For yellow man, um, help me out the same way because I me never, me never boss. Yes. Make it. Yes. Then, you know, me, I, me, when sometimes I see yellow man, I walk from the to burn on um, a scarf, you know, a juice land, and I walk from juice land, I go water. Oh. So when people say I drive, no, no. <laughs> so when people say players, I drive. Oh, I was a water. <laughs> <laughs> no. no so when people say they care, I say I drive, no players. Then if I have a problem, I will be working for team. No, I'm still a walk to come on till it's say, you know, when you walk, you know, you get exercise. Yes. Yes. You know, the people that want to sit down, sit down, is laziness. Yes. 
So we still walk, we still walk. So can what? Fit and firm enough can walk. <laughs> fit and firm and can walk. <laughs> yeah. Even though, um, yeah. in terms of the name pliers, because uh, you know the pliers, the spana bana, mm -hmm. you know Richie, Sp uh, Richie Spice. Uh, who gave you the name pliers? Where did that come from? Dignitary stylish. Dignitary stylish. Mm, one DJ was in Just Send Me Come. Okay, Just Send Me Come. Yeah. Just, just Send Me Come. Yeah. I want to tell you someone gave me a uh, Sonic Dynamic Sound, a record, a song for um, Name Bias, them Bias for uh, Jack Scarpio. Mm -hmm. And him say, Yo, what a man so I pin I don't pinch out that road there. Eh? I don't pinch out all the vice in room. Yeah. What a man so like pinchers. A player's him for him. Yeah. I know Jack him the man, Jack Scott is a man, I love the them look a vibe then yeah. because as a matter of fact, some of them, yeah boy God know I love them, but some of them wouldn't even, you know, some of them they really need to put in more of the music too. Yes. You know, the creation of the music. But yeah. he did glad for that because he know say at the end of the day that will sell me too. Yes. You know, because players pinch us people are gonna say, wait. Come and say, so like picture. Yes. So, what, what were you, what was your name before you got Pliers? Yeah, and Banda, I'm the Ghana, I'm right oh, name. yeah, Ghana, your right name. Okay, yeah, yeah. okay, all right. So, the players come out and it just stick. And then him go build an album. Now, when do you know, what Scarpia do you know, him, him have some song with Pinchers. Yes. So, him get some songs from me and just put them together and put me on one side and put Pinchers on one side. Ah, Pinchers and Pliers. Yeah. <laughs> come out and. Sell it and make money. Yeah? So when did you get your big break? When would you say was the moment you got your big break that solidified you as a, an artist that was here uh, to make his mark and to make his impact? The big break, it, it was with me and Chakademus. Yes. And most of the songs with me and Chakademus do is not really new songs yes. when they see me make. The songs with me yes, had before. before. Like all of them sang there were songs before. Yes. But me never really like, get the right um justice when it comes to uh, the music part, which is the rhythm. Yes. You know, because me used to try to get to King Jamis, but because so much DJ and sing I was around there, I mean I come from country and about no know me. Yes, yes. It's kinda of difficult for really reaching to mm. Jamis now for go past some of them rhythm. <coughs> yes. I mean, have good songs where me never even record. Yes. But when you get the rhythm then with certain certain rhythms or certain um Producer make where you not know, fully make, finish make, and all of that. When you sing your song, pandemic go nowhere because Jamie's used to do some good work. Yes. You know? So talk to me about how did you meet? Okay, so as a solo artist, you're doing your thing, uh, you know, you're putting out songs, mm -hmm. not necessarily getting that push or that recognition that you need and that you know you have mm -hmm. based on your talent. Yeah. How did you uh, make the link with Shaka Demos? Well, um. Who was also, uh, you know, having one's got one, one burger man, man, one bear, bear. shoot, shoot him. <laughs> <laughs> hey, if I love that song one more time, uh, I gotta tell you, pick up Shaka Demos, you know what I mean? Yeah. So, how did that link, uh, how was that link? How was that link that come about when um, Clinton Lindsay, um, a virgin from New York, who used to do a lot of uh, 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 pro promotion, mm -hmm. uh, you know, steel shoes, um, sent for. Um, also on here if you do a, a tour. Uh, you know, Chaka Demos was on the list, Shaba Ranking, uh, uh, Sanchez, Lady G, a lot of it, mm -hmm. you know. So it's like we sit down in the embassy them time they were sit down in there mm -hmm. together. And, you know, Demos start reasoning me and the man say, Well go and sing on me, I say, they are man good. Them time them the man, you know, we all, me I think Deep and a aim for, for high, for reach the sky. Yes. Something out of light. Me not even talk to people, me not talk, me not laugh. Mm -hmm. Me not stay so. Mm -hmm. So when the DJ, but my good, I could have deal with same way, I could have talked to. When the DJ come and me and my reason and I say, yo, I love your song, you know. You think good, man, I love how you go on, you go on, man, I love your singer. You song them one pinch charge, man. I love your thing there, man. <laughs> <laughs> Yeah. Yeah, and we start from this and we realize that the time I live at Portmore. Yes. And I realize that Portmore is there and thing and you know what I mean? We go up on the tour and you know Clinton separate us. Like he would have put me and Lady G somewhere and put Sanchez and Shaba somewhere and Chaka, you know? Yes. In a different states. Then. Yes. And then uh book tour done and I come back in Jamaica and see him. See Chaka Demos, me link him and him say, uh, mm -hmm. we reason. Mm -hmm. 
Yes, reason. Mm -hmm. Okay, we had a show in, in, in Bridgerton. In Bridgerton, had a show in Tampa. Name Purple Man had a show in Tampa. And Chakademus introduced him to me and said, uh, he, uh, he like my vibe and he like how I sing. And a humble youth man, more you put him on the show and Purple put him on the show. So me and Chakademus went to Tampa and did the show. And, you know, I would perform before him because he was the star for the show. Mm -hmm. And then, no, I'm get my far with him, see, because I still used to get my far with him. Yes. And thing. So, they must perform. And after they must come off of the stage, they must, when, they, when me come off, they must go on and perform. And they must come back up on the stage. Yes. To do some freestyle. Yes. And we start freestyle some songs together, and then that was the better part, the best part of the show because that was the biggest, bigger for our Yes, day. yes, yes. Yeah, and uh, when the show finished, Demo said, "Boy, we put them songs out together, man. Combination mm -hmm. and yeah, in fly go Japan after that with some show. You know what I mean? Me never really have the name it for them giving up Japan to uh, certain things so. up." I'm going to Rochester in New York and yes. sit down with some friends. Yes. And do some business along the way. Mm -hmm. And you know what I mean? I come back to Jamaica after certain business. <laughs> I come back to Jamaica, you know? And then um, link up with Demos again and we start record. Mm -hmm. And when we start record, we do a song named Girl Wine. Yes. And the entire chart, you know, in first song together. Girl Wine entered a chart in, a, in a England called the Black Echo Chart. That was like a big regular chart at them time. Eh? Yes. And uh, it's still number one for 13 weeks. And then we start do some songs together. We realize, we realize a lot of producers start coming now and I say, they want me to record, they want me to do album, they want me to do album, they want me to do single. That's how I go on. Yes. But Fatis Burrell usually. After a while, so I linked me now to through, through them yes. time, but me never have an idea what was going on in England. Yes. And um, I linked me a man to me and I was Spanish down and I was down and them things and I start doing an album for Fatis and see my drive on car, eh? on station or on car, <laughs> I go to, and I said to him, said, God, you know, I love driving on a car to Fatis. Yes. Yeah. Um, station or on thing and nice. Mm -hmm. I said, oh, I'm to your road, boy. You swamp them things, man. But them know I go on England and I have a clue. Yes. See? So after a while now, I realized, say, we had some songs, and the songs them with me and Chaka Demos are it. Because at the end of the day, when the time I realized now, say, me have from number one to number eight. Mm -hmm. From the chart, it's going to have a song named Terror. Mm -hmm. So between me and Chaka Demos, and Spanabana is nine songs mm -hmm. and the top ten. Yes. You know what I mean? Me did it uh, so far not no, <laughs> go on. I ride ride all the old bicycle about the place and them thing there. And some man called for a show. He two show in England and he must say he nah to them now. And I said, God no I'm ready to go over there so far. He really nah to them. But I don't know why he must wouldn't take the two show them become like he must I mean, you know, they must have a clue of mm -hmm. where they're going. Because the two show them would kind of cheat. Yes. Same, same, no one of them. So still a lot of promoters now start calling for shows. So we end up to take some show, I think, with about eight shows at the time. And they must have go up there. And when they're going to England, it's like, all of the other regular artists, they need to do it for show. They have to cancel them things. They have to come home. Wow. Because Shaka the Muslim players yeah. picked up um, steam that yeah, time. Yeah, it's now. like... What happened? Our, our success, I think, is more abroad. Mm. Even though Jamaica creates us, it's like the success is more overseas. Great success. Nice things happen that we don't talk about. Yeah, well, talk to me about them right here on Miss Kitty Live. That's why you're yeah. here. <laughs> That's why you're here, you know, to tell yeah, us. I because mean, a lot of times, people, we're here in Jamaica, and a lot of people are not, you know, traveling. And yeah. uh, back then, you know, obviously, we had no computer in terms yeah. of, you know, internet. Ah, and that kind of, you know, yeah. the 90s. Uh, mm. More pen pal, True. bright letter, yeah, you know, something. seal it, envelope, put on the stamp, go to post office. Uh -huh. It's not like, no, you could just send an email, oh, or you could go on Google, or you could just, you know, yeah, at the I mean, touch of a button, True. the world 
is at your fingertips. It wasn't like that uh, back mm -hmm. then. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So talk to us about some of the things that were happening for Shaka Dimas and Fires. Me now, with the tour, I'm come back in Jamaica and they have like about um, like about two months. Because now we do a album now for For, for, for Island. It's like when you do the album for Slide. Yes. Like, you know, I'm a pre like Island record mm -hmm. at the time. I do the album for like Slide. Mm -hmm. Murder Shrew. Yes. And then I did it now for like two or three months now. I made them say, I'm going to go on the chart, you know. They want to go back in England because we've gone on the chart and they want us to do promotion, radio and TV promotion and radio because we've gone on the chart. But I said, when I just come from England and Mash up, or mash up the chart. Now we did from the point to number nine. We mean the from the chart. But when we reached now England, we realized it was a different the chart. chart. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Yeah. And a black echo chart that yeah. tell you. It was a chart and called um, international. Like it was like British national chart. Then. Yes. With a song called Tease Me. Mm -hmm. And the white lady pick us up at the airport in a limousine and I said, oh, well, go on, yeah. <laughs> look like new tune got a number. <laughs> <laughs> the little youth from Rock Hall, yes, they are England. Picked up at the airport yeah. in the limo. So I said, oh, go on. And then we get to realize the lady had created the excitement that says, long time I didn't reckon to have a sweet single. There's a door. Oh, you guys are so great. Was tease me enter the chart, you know. Mm -hmm. So that was so murder she wrote came first. Yeah. And then that was but but murder she wrote was a mega hit in Jamaica. Yeah, not Jamaica alone, Miss Kitty. Yeah, the world, yeah. Globe. Yeah, it was it like went global. Miss Kitty, we could never me and Chaka Demos go on stage nowhere and sing murder she wrote three times or four times. Yeah. You have to be all ten. Wow. It's like you could just do the show with that song. Yes. And if you sing, and if they follow what you could do, everywhere, like everywhere. Yeah. From even Russia, mm. because everywhere. But um, it's like, um, tease me now, take over England by storm, even do murder, she wrote the same thing, and enter another the chart. Mm -hmm. I don't know. Just music. Yeah. And we love it. <laughs> <laughs> We're talking to players of Shakadimas and Flyers this afternoon. They'll be performing at Shaggy and Friends on Saturday. And, of course, he is giving us, uh, you know, a rundown, you know what I mean? I take us down memory lane from when he came, from where he started, and where he is now. Nationwide Night FM, Miss Kitty Live with DJ Calico and my very special guest, Pliers. Underage gambling is illegal. You can be fined and imprisoned for enabling a minor to engage in gambling activities. Call Prime Stop at 311 to report illegal gambling. The time by the Betting Gaming and Lotteries Commission is... 3.50. Yeah, I'm on the wrong end phone. Just... Come on, baby, yeah. let the good times roll. Come Exchange. on, baby, let the good times roll. Come on, baby, let the good times roll. Roll on that love. Come on, baby, let the children sing. Come on, baby, let the children sing. Yeah. Come on, baby, let the good times roll.
Miss Kitty live on your radio here, fluffing up your afternoon on a pepper seed Thursday. Ply is my very special guest here in studio with me, and I gotta tell you, he has a, such a very colorful history. But it is good to know your history because if you don't know where you're coming from, then you won't know where you're going. Okay. And I gotta tell you, he has the songs, the catalog is there, the legacy is there, and he continues to grow and to soar. And of course, we're very happy to have him in studio right now. So, the link between Chakademos. And you know that combination made the difference uh, in the career yeah. because then now you start do the things them and you know mm -hmm. uh, the doors started to open. Yeah. So talk to me about some of the you know the good things, the great things, the doors that that combination opened for you. Um, Kitty just beautiful. You know? Yeah. Cause look here, um, me never really want me to listen to music in Jamaica. Mm -hmm. How we hear them stay in Jamaica. I we hear some maybe go to the Caribbean, but yeah. I'm seeing on the Jamaica scene. Yes. Like, you could go in America and see a community, a Jamaican scene where like. Me didn't want to go global across yes. the world must hear what I say. Yes. Listen Different to, races, yeah. class and creed. Yeah. Mm -hmm. So that was one of my aim and that was one of my dream and it come true. Nice. So uh then now we start to we start to get some nice vibe, nice energy, good treatment from people at the street, from the fans, from the record company. Um, everything was like lovely. We feel like we, we like we start to get superstar energy and mm -hmm. vibe and feeling. Yes. Which we never push out because at the end of the day, you know, we're still up to now and I feel that we just feel like we are doing music and yes. want to happy, lovely music, positive yeah. music that people can you know, love and enjoy and everything that has. I mean, you don't know you have the world is big and it make up a lot of different people, different mentality, different vibe, different energy. And we have some positivity, you know? Yes. So at the end of the day, you know, that was very beautiful but um so we recognize that um we realize sorry we realize that the, the, the world recognizes we Yes. You know, and um I like I like a lot of things that I like like uh, the, 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 when Alicia Keys called for the American Music Award, mm -hmm. I mean, really love, appreciate that. I mean, I say yes, at least I'm starting to appreciate I know, because I remember Bob Marley said, play on the R&B, I want all my people to see we're bubbling on the top 100 like a mighty dread. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's like that. Yeah. And, you know, the BT Award and all them things. But before them things, I mean, and demons usually go on BT, you know. Yes. We do interviews on the BT, the MTV, the, you know, you name it. Yes. But um, I did really appreciate and that what Alicia did and the love that she shows us, the respect, you know. Nice. Respect and love and, every time. And more things, some more people. Yeah. In terms of, uh, so the Tease album, and of course, I Want to Be Your Man, I mean, that was a big song. Like, I want to understand. <laughs> I wanna be your man. Hey, that's song, you know. <laughs> ah, but, no, I'm a tone. Look here, Eller. I, I'm a player fan. Yeah. I know these things. You know what I mean? Mr. Yolo you know, is a burning fan. I'm a soul. <laughs> <laughs> Listen, so we know the things, right? And I'm quite sure that a lot of your fans who are listening now on the radio and watching you on my Facebook Live, they are just ex as excited um, as I am as a person, you know, of musical history. And you know the music and you love the music. Miss Kitty, that song, I want to be your man. You know, say, you know the song, I want to be your man. I want to be your man. You know that song? Yes. Ah, but... So me go some book now and go, I want to be oh. a man, I want you to understand, I want to be a man, same, same, I'm stuck at least. Yes, <laughs> <laughs> I'm a teacher. Yeah, so, so baby. Yes. at the end of the day though, the song going on a movie called uh, Poetic Justice with yes. Janet Jackson. John and Tupac, yes. And it sell a lot too because, you know, we pick up bowl and fight at certain places and things, so the guy them who created that song that I want to be a man, it, come in with some last two thing. Mm -hmm. But when it run through, them realize that they can't win because, you know, them go, 
Yes. So no copyright infringement yeah. at all. So when that, okay, I mean, you know, so your song is in a movie and Poetic Justice was a big movie. Mm -hmm. It was a big deal. Uh, in terms of the tours and the audiences uh, for whom you perform, talk to me about some of the shows uh, that you would do in the world and where. So where did, you, you know, the music take you? And talk to me about some of the audiences for whom you performed. Uh... We, the first time biggest audience biggest biggest, crowd. Uh, biggest crowd was uh brazil mm -hmm. but that was with chakademus and players and um shabba Ramkin and uh inner circle and maxi priest yes and that was like about a hundred and fifty thousand people people like fainting like wow like you know, like p too much people together. Yes. Like fainting. It's just, like the heat. Crazy yes. People. They might put them past church and like, move them out, move them out. It was like, wow, crazy. Next show, next thing remember is that the first time we were in Africa. And the first show, it was Uganda. Yes. When we reached the airport, it's like, you remember how it looked when Bob Marley did that? Mm hmm the people them you know, the tree, tree mm -hmm. them, and the people them lying the road as far as from the hotel to from the airport, airport to the hotel people line up go straight to them and it's a, 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 a door, but it's a very long way mm -hmm. it's a very long distance that was um another memory and russia yes russia um was like when we sit down at the dressing room like when we sit down here in, in here now, I say, oh, what we have to do with it? Why do people bring me to this place? Mm -hmm. What we have to sing for these people? Can they talk English? When they talk, well, we got a lot of places, as you know, yes. this kitty, when yes. this place. But well, when we're looking at the water, like them give a water, when we're looking at the bottom of the water, it was like a portion of a dirt settled. But them say it was iron, really. Mm -hmm. It was like weird. Mm -hmm. Uh, what we all do, I mean, worry, my heart, jump. You see, when Miss them come and say, five minutes for stage, it's like, yo. <laughs> <laughs> we out. Nothing, because me I say, yo, me not take a lot of drink, me not say nothing for drink. <laughs> them send for some red rum, and yeah, red rum, me just clap with some red rum. <laughs> 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 yeah. Uh, but, Miss Kitty, when I go there and step on the stage, it's like, Michael Jackson come. Wow. I swear to God, it was like crazy. Then the rain start fall, nobody move. If it's the people them holding one another trampling on the mud. We do some nice things, man, I, I wrote and uh we make a feel good, you know, get the, the all the people that accept us, we feel nice. Really nice. And I, of course, we feel nice when you give us the great songs as well, when we can dance to them and sing to them. Plaz, my very special guest right here on Miss Kitty Live. We're going to talk about some more about his career, what he's doing now, and of course, what we can expect from him this Saturday uh, on Shaggy and Friends on the lawns of Jamaica House with his partner in crime, Shaka Demos. It is Miss Kitty Live right here on Nationwide 90 FM. Hey. Some people, sometimes you know, you're that far. Mm -hmm. And you're the, the biggest radio station them in, the, in the world. Thank you. And you know, Miss Kitty, them sit down, go on like MSHA, and them shy. And don't know, and yeah, I'm, 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 I'm doing a boring interview. Mm -hmm. It's like how oh, you professional. Mm -hmm. You might go on a BT in America. Oh, and a MTV but, and a big radio yeah, station yeah, in America. Sure. In the, eh? A lot of them, this is the problem we have with them. When, when we send the buyer, we give them, they will look over the buyer. And because they will know the thing, they will know faster. That's <laughs> yeah, the problem. Yeah, the but I even in the early days, Miss Kitty. Yes. You know the nineties. <coughs> what we are the, the, the big radio station. I'm sorry, Chuck and they have visit. And the people them like Oh, uh, the them, 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 them don't. Them have a vibe? No. Yeah. Them, them, them can't ask questions. It's like, maybe them just play with it. They don't play with it. Yeah. Them just, them just not good. Yeah, but God, you? So at the end of the day, sometimes you might like, oh, me that Jamaican, yeah, man. 
Foreign you deal with a per uh, interview and, and the way the person deal with you can say yes, this person is very professional yes. like you. Thank you. Thank you. With no apology. Thank you. Some of them are big, like them are big this and that and you're going to deal with it. Thank yeah, you. Me here, think they complain about that, you know. Rescue Snoop Dogg, you know. Oh, yeah? Mm -hmm. And me and him are, uh, and, uh, think they're the final road on time. Yeah, yeah. Martina, so they may turn on the headphones. Video footage showed a fire blazing through at least one carriage near a crushed car. Iran has No, the headphones. It said the U.S. leadership yeah. numerous observers yeah. yeah. and scientific Ukrainians. Thank you. I appreciate it. It's so loud. You go. You want water? No, my boy. Oh, okay. I can get you one. <laughs> no, no, I'm oh, thank you. One, my, you fight against you still? No, I'm so not. I give my one. You still, I get the one as well. Okay. Uh, <laughs> we we'll come up with a murder. She wrote it here. Um. Yeah, man. Oh yeah, and please, we we'll talk about the um when you guys opened for UB40. Oh. Yeah. <laughs> you know, from there, yeah, yeah, yeah. UB40, nice man. No, no, something about them vice. Them about. Yeah. Yeah? Okay. No, that's what I'm telling you. That's what I'm telling you. Kitty, no. Is we do our like research. Um, <laughs> sir. I don't like no, but I don't like no. Yeah, yes, Calcutt. Yeah. We don't run. I don't run party listen, shop. <laughs> listen to me. I just told them that New York. Thanks, Carl. We asked me say if we can do the interview today. Brother. <laughs> yeah, I'm right. sure you say. So that's what I'm sure. I lock up in a place from so nine o'clock in the morning. The time when they say me and Chaka D must dead. <laughs> all over the world. Oh, no. Me lock up in a, in a place from 9 o'clock in the morning and about 10 o'clock in the night, me and he must come out to eat lunch. And like somebody from the record company comes and call him and call him say you're dead in New York. <laughs> and everybody have it over a radio station and say we're dead. And me talk to a whole lot of people. And people that professional, professionals are still not professional. Mm -hmm. I have real professional people. I have professional people. Take it as me tell them about that, man. Some of them know them, man. Some people come out there. Yeah. Some send me there, sir. Yeah. <laughs> no, yeah. not Miss Kitty Live. <laughs> well, you're full of energy. That's what you mean. Life, no, because when you, love what you, when you love what you do, you put your all yeah, into it, it. And, you know, you have to just make yeah, sure so you do what you have to mm -hmm, do. Mm -hmm. And you are professional. That's and, it. you know, I'm a lover of music and I am very passionate about my job. So yeah. you have to put in the work. You know what I mean? But take my thing serious. Me and Jordan. You know what, Mafisa? Yeah. Sometimes, yeah, yeah, yeah. Sometimes I'm not going to do it with my hair, but I'm going to do it with my biggest Yes. Oh, yeah? Yeah, what? La 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 Come out, uh, but I have to dash a cold. Don't touch me, 
and pliers <laughs> is here okay so, <laughs> so need a redeem i gotta tell you oh, one of my favorite songs hi pliers how are you how did i did i do the dj part good wonderful i gotta tell you <laughs> no like i remember when this song came out calico where were you when this song came out Sorry. Ooh. Yeah, you remember this song? Yes. Monster hit. Okay. Inspired every day. Every day, every like day. you uh, listen. Yes, yeah, no, Tell no, us no. about the Back video up. for this song. You know what? The, the video for the song, um, the first video. Oh, yeah. Yeah, yeah. The original video. Original. You know, really, uh, to white people, Trish Parrell. Yes. And another white lady come here, and she come with a little camera. I mean, and Dean was over Elsha. Then give us some like, flowers looking shirt yeah. and pants. <laughs> yeah. I'll yeah. put them on. I she alone, you know, use a little camera and video the song, you know. Yeah. And when you look for MTV and every, v every, 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 every TV station over the world. Yeah. And it's 2,000 US dollars. Wow. Then the, then the girl put in the video. And the one that spend what, hundred and twenty-five thousand dollars. Them not play. Wow. It's a two thousand video here, yes, you know. Wow. Ever station over the world. Wow, uh, absolutely amazing. When you saw the video and when you saw the finished product, how did that make you feel? Wonderful, Miss Kitty. You know, and I'm um, Colleen. Did a beautiful. Yes. Picture. Big up dancehall queen Colleen. Oh, I tell us everyone we're going to the world all in America every time we reach the. the um... I thought her name was Maxine at first. No. Maxine is in Jamaica. Oh yeah. yeah. <laughs> big, big up, up big up Maxine. <laughs> She's not Miami, but she come in, you know. Yeah. Start out our business. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. So that video with Carlene, I mean, in yeah. that gold, um, I think it was a short and a thing, and it yes, was a whole a gold shot. Gold, gold shot. And Chaka the was in a black, yes, and, and gold earring and white hair. Yeah. And you were in like a big shirt them time. I mean, if a biggie met that outfit there. No. <laughs> a biggie? No. Oh, okay. A island girl with a short. Island. Well, it had that, it had that biggie type of look, you know what I mean? I think Shaka Dimos was in a black and gold um thing, yeah, like man. a vest thing. Exactly. Yeah, man. Yes, really man. Really <laughs> and the blue shorts, I mean, that was Yes, man. yes. Uh, like a rag, you know? Yeah, like yes, yes, <laughs> yeah. Yeah. But that's great. Yeah. It's beautiful. Well, I want you to talk to me about, um, you know, uh, it, it, the, when you opened for the British group, uh, UB40. Mm -hmm. And I mean, UB40 as well, another big group, you know. Mm -hmm. And so for Shaka Demos and Pliers to open for uh, UB40, that was also a big deal. Uh, talk to us about that. And what did that do for your career? Miss Kitty, you know, say, if I tell you from my uh, you know, most of the time, it's, if, if I ever tell the truth, you see, you find out the truthfulest person. <laughs> And if you tell the truth, it was beautiful. Yes. But it wasn't no special <laughs> excitement and them things. Because at the end of the day, me and Demos, before that tour with we and you before, them did, I think they put on three of the shows, or seven of the shows, I don't remember. But they put on some of the shows and them treat us very nice because it's them to get rent all the um, private jet that we could have. Man put that, you know, smoke mm -hmm. and like, smoke mm -hmm. on it and mm -hmm. all that man. You know, uh, you know, like, when you get time out, like Sunday day time, they like, usually uh, rent a uh, big boat and go to yes, the sea yeah, and stop. a party. And it was beautiful with them, but um, we had good experience before before that, but it was good. Mm -hmm. I mean, we realized, say, uh, you be fatty, know that we are giants. Yes. Like, 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 like them. Yes. And uh, how we, we, we are giants yes. in the music business. Yes. You see, this music business, Miss Kitty, all you have to do is just follow up and continue to do what you are doing. Yes. You see, the people that call you out for work? Yes. You have to just go do your work. Yes. Do your job. Yes. Do your, all we need for dinner, what we were doing, interviews, stage shows. Yes. And then you becomes like the biggest star in the world. 
no matter where you come from, once you play good music, yes. I find good melody and good lyrics. Nice. You're good. I remember she don't let nobody. She don't let nobody, nobody but me. Yeah, <laughs> I gotta tell you. It was good with you, Fatty, and I can tell you 100%. It was a, a pleasure doing shows with them on stage and things. And I realized them look at me and Chaka Demos and usually even start to pattern our style of performance. Yes. And we are saying, the band people, they say, the same performance, everything with them, so we them guys are full of magic. Yes. And so you opened the door also for your brothers. I mean, Richie Spice, uh, Spana Bana, uh, the, you know, the Bonner Brothers, you know, doing... Suppose me tell us, I mean, I know say Spana could have seen. Wow. Because me in the street up and down until me leave a call and go in a casa of a piece, go live. Mm hmm I tell me like about 22, I'm going to go live with that girl and say dance, go, go. Yeah, you know, me just run now, me just run. Me just run out, I'll go for Balboa Avenue, no, no, no. Yeah, I've been at the place and there and thing and she used to treat me out nice with and thing. But me up now in the ghetto there and thing for a while. I'm going up to the hills and me and my mother tell me that Spana can't sing. Say, hey, but when I grew up in the yard together and I like we just separate, I'm never hear Spana sing. Mm -hmm. When I sing, I say, why well, nobody can sing in my vibe, man? Yes. And so, um, we take him to studio first. He came around Winston Riley. See, first time he came to the studio, some man come from England and want a song, some producer. We sing a song for them and we well, span going to sing for them, but span get nervous, you know? Because mm -hmm. I'm saying, I'm in the vice room and the whole vice room would have spin, you know? What? So I'm very nervous. So I take him to Winston Riley. Winston Riley, I Winston Riley recorded him, you know, and then she tell me, say, Richie can't sing too. Yes. So I'm listening to Richie, I'm saying, oh, you have talent, man, you have a talent. Yeah. And me bring in Richie around me after. Then tell him to leave from Cassava Peace, now with Richie, I'm going to live around and place near Edgewater in a pool. Oh, yes. I have Richie Road out me because I say I have to leave up there so I come around here now because mm -hmm. you sound like you have talent and I did it with Richie, you know, as a bigger brother, I try with him and thing and you know what I mean, produce some songs with him. My last song with him, pretty not pretty living ain't easy with him and snatcher. Yes. It's me produce that song there. It's not pretty no. Yeah. And till him He found his own path. Him talent, you yes. know, so he just got through. Fifth element. Yeah. Just like that. Yeah, Nationwide yeah. 90 FM, Miss Kitty Live. Ply is in the studio, I gotta tell you. You know, I mean, Murder She Wrote was just like one of those songs. Tease me, she don't let nobody twist and shout. I want to be your man. So talk to me about, about what is Shaka Demons and Ply is doing now? Are you still touring? What are you doing? And what does your itinerary look like for 2018? Well, what we're doing now, we are in the studio. Uh, Chaka Demos, uh, well, the Chaka Demos finish is solo album. Okay. I am working on a solo album right now, too. To be released when? To be released uh, April. Okay. April, which is my birth month. Oh, yeah, nice, lovely. Yeah. What what date? The 10th. Okay, the 10th. And is the album yet titled? Uh, it's the, the, Yeah, I'm going to title it the, the single that I'm promoting now, In It To Win. Okay, In It To Win. In It To Win It. Okay, so In It To Win very, It. Very, very, very positive songs for the kids or the people who are trying to uh, succeed in life. Yes. You know, we'll make them know, so don't give up on your goals, you know. And anything you do, you can survive. You can survive it. You can win it. I want the people them support me on it because at the end of the day it is positive. And yes. Jamaica kinda of depend on a, a little vibe now we two do them like yesterday me say eleven murder go on since here start. So I want the people them and the media to support start to support us with a little positivity. Like yes. man like all me now. You know what I mean? And I mean like we just we just need the positive some positive. The spice and spanner man and snap China. Yes. Is that what does that one have a title? No, not yet, but we still have it because we have a single right now. We really about make the people them jump for happy and jump for joy. Yes. Richard love it like every time I'm driving up at the yard, he play it ten times before I'm coming. <laughs> <laughs> because yeah. Richard spice, yeah. So you know what I mean. And next year now we have the cruise march. Yes. Yeah. Uh, Dalton Pinnock, you know, is oh. the manager. Hi, Dalton Pinnock. Good afternoon to you. Yes. Big up. Yeah, what is it? What is it like working with uh with pliers? 
Um, <clears throat> come on, Mr. Pinoca, yes. <laughs> just line up my, my, my management. Question again. Again. What is it like working with pliers? What is it like working with pliers? I mean, kind of challenging at times, but... <laughs> yes. Talk the truth, I got love. Yeah, man, the truth, the yeah. truth. Yeah, man, talk the truth. Yeah. Challenging. Yeah. But some, most of the times we get, we, get, we get where we want to go. What are you most proudest about in terms of, you know, being affiliated with his brand, being affiliated and being a part of his team? Well, two nice artists I have around me still, Chakarimas and Plyas. Two good artists around me. And... As I say, challenging sometimes, you know, three different characters meet. Mm -hmm. So we have three different opinions going three different directions. But 99.9% of the time, we end up going to the right part. You know? Have you heard the album In It To Win It? The song In It To Win It, yes, yes. man. Yeah, and what do you think about it? Yeah, I love it, I love it, I love it. Yeah, yes. and what can you tell uh, his fans what they can expect from Pliers? Great music. Yeah. Great music. Because he still have the passion for the music, right? Nice. Yes, so we just expect to get great music from him. And as we say, support it. Yes. And you enjoy whatever you get. Well, we haven't seen Shaka Dimas and Pliers perform in Jamaica for a while now, Pliers. So talk True to that. me about what we can get uh, or what your fans will get or be treated to uh, this Saturday at Shaggy and Friends. Well, Miss Kitty, we'll be getting an excellent performance from Shaka Dimas and Pliers. Yes. As always, yes. You know we're very uh, experienced the business now and veteran the business. Yes. You yeah. know we can angle ourselves nice on stage and we can make the people them feel nice with music. We sing nice music, so we know the people is gonna enjoy what Chaka Dimos and um, full joy what Chaka Dimos and players is have to offer to them. I know they're gonna love it. <laughs> they're gonna love it. Yeah. And it what, do you have children, Spana? I mean, I mean, Flyers. Flyers. Mm. Uh, are you married? Are you, you know, have kids? What's, yeah. what's going on with the family? <laughs> yeah, I'm married, you know. Yeah? Yeah. Like, how long now? Uh, like, about 10 years. About 10 years, yes. Where's your wife? She's at work. Hi! <laughs> <laughs> Flyers wife, they work. Flyers wife, and it was Flyers at work, but afternoon. <laughs> uh, she work up on part of um, New Kingston and Carl. And crew scheduling thing. Oh, okay. What's her name? She crew the plane. She named Kalila. Oh, okay. Alicia. Oh, hi, Mrs. Bonner. Bonner. Yeah? And how many children do you have? Me. Let me get... <laughs> <laughs> See, the story I come to bump, you know. Let me get about seven kids. Okay, seven children. All right. And what kind of father? Are you the disciplinarian type father? Are you the fun dad? Are you the... What kind of dad are you? I mean, that man just show them the right things. Yeah. Talk to them and show them the right things, you know? Yes. I mean, when I have a little time, I can't laugh with them because I love kids crazy. Yes. Love them. Yeah. But, like, good. Yes. I'm not going to say bad. I mean, I tell you, say, when I get to hug them up, me usually they on the road, you know, my first son, them, me used to run off of the road early before them drop asleep. Because I always want, when I'm in Jamaica, yes. I always want to run, go home, go get the light on from my back. I have there if you jump on my belly on my chest, you know. Yes, <laughs> nice. Yeah. Yeah. So, you know, I love kids. Nice. And are any of your children um, musically inclined? Are they yeah, anybody Tamar. looking like they're going to walk in your footsteps? Yeah, my wife is Sonny and Tama, you know. We love the, the my DJ still, but him love, you know, cartel um, style, him love cartel vibe and thing. I mean, him, 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 him really love it. And, I write him songs them and thing and I teach him, help him to, not yeah. really teach him but help him along with it and thing. But my first son really born in America, I say I sing to him. Right now I'll be a party man. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. Well maybe he'll find his path and his passion and calling uh, sooner than later. So when you're not performing, when you're not rehearsing, when you're not uh, you know, touring. What do you enjoy doing? What do What do you do? I like farming. Oh, really? Talk to me about that. Uh, I love plant stuff. Then. Oh yeah, you have I a love, farm? It's not really a really big farm, but I plant my pepper seed. Me want to pick up and have to buy it. Yeah. I plant cucumber in my yard. I plant pop chow. We have a whole heap of land up in the hills. The motor go up there. So uh, the other day, Mr. Richard bring out a lovely banana I can give over plant stuff. Nice. So if farming is your uh, thing. Yeah, and if me not really a farm, sleep. Yes. Do you play any sports? <laughs> <laughs> any football? Any, uh, any cricket? No, no, no. Because I love boxing. Oh, yeah? Um, That is one of my passions. I really did want that 
when I go come up like in life, if me did have the, if me if in my vision, if me see the success, when I could have successful in boxing, if me see the opportunity around me, yeah, I'll be a boxer. Who is your favorite boxer of all time? Uh, Muhammad Ali yeah. and, and Joe Frazier. Float uh, like, like a butterfly, yeah. sting like a bee. I'm like um, a lot of them. Come watch. Hey, if you see me jump up on my bed, I'll, <laughs> I'll be there at home by myself. If you see me on the bed, I'll, I'll jump. Man, yeah. like me a fight. <laughs> I love it. <laughs> What's your favorite color? Every football again, be a big guy, be a boxer. Be a boxer, yeah? yeah. What, what's your favorite color? I love blue, I love red. And your favorite meal to eat? Like, so <coughs> if you're taking pliers out, or you know, when next you're gonna come, when your album is released, and I'm gonna cater for you guys, what should I make sure that I have in my studio? Sea fish. Okay, a sea fish. Sea okay. fish, I come out there, I see. <laughs> <laughs> you know, it's like, yeah, mother. Yeah. No, call the police. Yeah. No, you can call somebody. Call the police. Call the police. Call the No, call the ambulance. Yeah. 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 Sea yeah. fish. Yeah. 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 Roast yeah. or fry. Yeah. Yeah. Just sea fish. Oh, my God. Yeah. 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 So sea fish would what? So you want it steam, you want it roast, you want it brown straw. Any other you want it. Any other you want <laughs> We're talking to pliers today. We're talking to pliers. He's my very special guest on Miss Kitty Live on a Pepper Seed oh. Thursday. Um, in terms of you know looking back at your career now, uh, you're more mature now. You're more experienced, as you said. You know you're a veteran now. Uh, would you do anything differently when looking back, or the pliers that you are now? What advice would you give? to the players or to Everton Bonner from Rock Hall? If you could talk to that person now, what advice would you give? I would tell them to um, first, if you really check around, there's a God. Yes. You want to believe or not. So you have to believe, um, put your trust there. And you know, we have to talk big man thing. Can we have to say, go believe in a God. Mm -hmm. And then we have to say, um, uh, perseverance, you yes. know. Is the key. I mean, like Miss Kitty, you have go to school. You want to be good in your grades, mm -hmm. so you have to study. Yes. Right. So you know, I mean, whatever you choose in life, you have to try to do your best. Yes. You know, hard working man achieve progress. Yes. Never give in. Listen to voice within that say you're in it to win. See? Wonderful, beautiful. Yeah. In it to win it, we're winning just like that. What would you like to say to your fans? Because you know, without them, uh, a lot of the success and the acclaim and the accolades that you have now, uh, you wouldn't have them. Uh, you know, they've supported your, your career over the years. What I, would you like to I, say to I, them? I, I, nobody. I don't. Think so. I, I was going to say I don't think, but nobody in the world will love them fans more than me. I love my fans, heart wise. Yeah. Fully love. Um, because at the end of the day, uh, you can go in, go sing, and but if you don't have nobody to support you, if you don't have the people, then you don't have nothing. Yes. So, you know, love and respect to my fans, and I want to say to all my fans to have a beautiful um, year. Yes. The year just started, it's a new year. Have a wonderful new, um, new year in the grace of God. Yes. And protection, and guidance, and love, and prosperity, and we um we, we, we put our foot for negativity and it can't get up because we now move till we sink it. Mm -hmm. Just like that. Well, Prosperity. I'm quite sure that Miss Violet is proud. Mr. Ivano is proud. That's, uh, and you did it. You know, you were in so it to win it and you did it. Definitely. And you are the personification of what resilience is, what tenacity is, what, you know, having that stick to itiveness and knowing that hard work is the key to success. Every time. And hard work overcomes all difficulties. There is no way around hard work. No. It is what it is. No, you have to make up your mind that you can't love, gaze out a thing and lag out a thing. Yeah. And drag it out. You have to, I mean, that's why sometimes people take vacation because they take time to rest. Yes. But there's time to work. You have to work. There's yes. time to sleep. And when yes. time to work, you work. There's a time and place for, for everything, everything under the sun yeah, that yeah. thy Lord give it thee. <laughs> Just like that. Do you have a, a, a Bible verse that you use all the time? or? No, 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 no. Yeah, Psalm 23 <laughs> never yeah. fails. So what song are you going to do for us today, uh, players, as we're going to go out right now? You know what I mean? And by the way, Mr. Pinock, where can we find him on social media? Because you know it's the inter it's um, internet age right now. Uh, where can we find you guys on social media? Uh, my Instagram is King Players. Okay. 
Twitter King Players, you know. Okay, so. Facebook King Players. But Mr. Um, Neville Pinnock, with the general yeah, my, my, my management, talk to them and make them know them can't find you when they can't walk. Yes, I'm sure and exactly. And if people want to book um, Shakademus and Pliers, who do we call? What's the number? Yes, well, the number, the office number is what? 718-649-0096. And the cell number is 347-680-1184. All right. That's uh, where you get a book in such academy. And any email address? Yes, it's D A L. So it's David, Alpha, Larry, Paul, India, Nancy, Nancy at AOL.com. The old school thing. What? AOL.com. <laughs> yeah, no, the no, A. Hey, the, 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 no, the A. Hey, no, that one day, that one day. <laughs> no, we not. We need to wake up about money for that one day. Oh yeah, God. Oh the AOL. It's a work, man. It's a work. Oh my, right now, right now, right now, L O L O day. A O L. A O L. That's so like. 19. Yeah, oh my god. Messenger days. Them, that's messenger. Yes. Well, that's that's a dial up. It's good to still have it, man. Sometimes we can't reach when they come check with. They're it's still have it. No, a pe no, a pepper seed turns of a train of Kelly Cole. <laughs> but not tell her. That email I just yeah. said, it's a rare coat. Yeah, it's yeah. falling line. Can you see any old big part on a Friday? It would have come out. So it's a rare kid. It's a rare kid. It's a rare kid. A O L. It's a rare still one. <laughs> ah! Oh my god. I gotta tell you. I just said, dial up. It's about a <laughs> slow <laughs> You gotta get the dialogue. Lovely, lovely. Well, gentlemen, thank you so very much for being here. Uh, I wish that you know. I wish you all the success. Thank you so very much for the legacy, the catalog, the hard work that you have invested in the music, thank you. for being a brand ambassador for Jamaica thank and you, the sir. music, for always representing you know Jamaica in a positive way and in a professional way. I've never heard anything bad about chocolate and pliers being unprofessional or whatever it is, you know mm -hmm. what I mean? And that is really great. And when it comes down to it, uh, you know, you don't just represent yourself, you represent a culture, you represent exactly. a people, and you have done so uh, in a very reputable way and in a great way. And we want to say thank you. Uh, sometimes Sometimes, you know, our own artists, um, our own celebrities, we don't uh, give them the acknowledgement they deserve enough. Mm -hmm. And sometimes people wait until people's eyes are closed. True. And at them time, they go port the tribute. Yeah, and they go say, Lord, him that good youth. Uh -huh. And Jano Star. And him big old. Well, on Miss Kitty Live, we don't wait until that time. Mm -hmm. We give respect. No, when we and we do it now when you can hear and when you can absorb it and when you can appreciate it. And so from the bottom of my heart, I appreciate you. I remember you. watching you. I mean, you, you know the song I'm ready for it. I'm sorry. Yeah, you understand? You have a little song book and you have a little course and you underline the course part <laughs> and you sing and the, the, the uh, exercise book with the eagle panita, you call it the eagle. <laughs> right, with a little elephant on a pencil. Yeah. And you have an HB2 <laughs> pencil. Yeah. Well, we used to come on entrance. Yeah. And so those songs live with us. And I'm quite sure uh, that a lot of people listening to those songs right now, mm -hmm. a lot of memories are coming back. Sure. Because songs are associated with memory, you know? Exactly. When you hear a song, you remember, boy, you remember you know, with that girl there? Sure. Boy, you remember that work at a place there? Mm -hmm. All of you, they start January, what they Monday there? You know what I mean? Like what the lawyer said to you in England, in America, and I'm like, the, the judge say. Why you guys did come? Why they did come long time? I've been listening to the song from I was going to college. Yeah. <laughs> there you go. You know what I mean? So I want to thank you for the hard work that you've put in. Yeah. Uh, again, you're an inspiration to somebody today. Uh, you know, that you it's not about where you're from. It's about where you want to go. Exactly. And once you're willing to put in the hard work, you're from Rock Hall, mm -hmm. rural Jamaica. Sure. You've been on stages with UB40, yeah. Alicia Keys, BET, VH1. Yeah. You know what I mean? You have been to Russia. You've been to Uganda. You've been all, all over the world. world. And, more. And, and more. And you have made it happen. So it, it, you go, it goes to show that dreams can come true. Exactly. Dreams do come true mm -hmm. when you're willing to put in the work. Mm -hmm. And God help those who help themselves and you make your mother proud and your father proud and you lift up your family name and I really am impressed by that I love you and I want to big you up for that and let me tell you this as I, as I, as I, as I say all over the world yes I don't know Come the place of Minogo and we do interviews all over the world. I'm not like you're very professional. Thank you. I can't believe it. It's like you move me. I can't believe it. <laughs> really. You know what I mean? God, no, you're really professional. Thank but you. But we check the global. 
status. Thank you, my darling. I respect you. I Thank love you. you. I want you to keep it up. <laughs> Thank like you. Like that and have a lo I know you are going to have a lovely year. I'm well, sure thanks. Speaking isn't to being my love. I'm in it to yeah. win it. So talk to me now. Which, which rhythm do I give it? Which rhythm do I want? Which rhythm do I want? Rhythm up. 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 Watch it. Give me a murder show today. <laughs> Why? Nationwide 90 FM, Miss Kitty Live. Living legend in my studio, talking about King Players from rural rock hall to the world. And of course, live right here on Nationwide 90 FM. He will be performing live on Saturday at Shaggy and Friends, along with Shaka Nemos. Watch it. I don't listen to the girl, her name is Maxine. Her beat is like a bunch of rose. If I ever tell you about Maxine, you say, I don't know what I know, but murder she wrote. Miss Kitty, a murder she wrote, murder she wrote, no, 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 murder she did. Watch Watch know me say, a pretty face and bad character, then they can a living care, oh, Miss Kitty, hey, a pretty face and bad character, then they can a living care, oh, Miss Kitty, so girl, you're pretty, your face is pretty, but your character dirty, girl, you just a act too, flirty, flirty, you run to Tom Dick, and also, hurry, and when you find your mistake, you talk about your sorry, Shaka Divas and players right here on Miss Kitty Live. Thank you guys. Yes. Hi guys, gonna take a picture. I'll be right back. Yes, darling. Thank you. Yeah, man. Of course. you tell me number for me. Of course. Right if I saw. I'm gonna make a lot some drops. Right if I need it. Thanks. That man. Revolutionary discussion. Yeah, 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 if you've ever struggled to pass an exam, then you'll know that students today are under great pressure to get good grades and secure qualification needed to move on to higher education. The problem is that too many students are struggling alone. <coughs> Connecting it with hardworking teachers and other bright students in other parts of the country and the region. Join me, Dennis Brooks, this and every Friday evening from 8 to 9, with a repeat on Saturday morning from 8 to 9. For the A-Team, a study group on radio, my team of teachers, students, and experts will break down the syllabus, giving you information, tips, and past paper questions that will help you get top grades in your upcoming exams. Follow us on Facebook Live and on Twitter and be a part of the community. It's the A-Team, Fridays at 8 p.m. with a repeat at 8 o'clock on Saturday morning. It's your free extra class on radio and social media. And it's right here on Nationwide 90 FM, the revolution in media. Sponsored by Collins Books and More. Love dictionaries, love Collins. Miss Kitty is on the People's Station Nationwide 90 FM Team Revolution All I'm going and I run around the world Like I can't get my girl 24 7 party and go back I'm stuck and he was back watching our star
Now you don't need to boast because you were the girl that I love the most. I love you from the pillow, I love you to toast, but all that you're gone, girl, you need to toast. So no matter what you do, it's over Supermarket in the Pavilion Mall is now open on Sundays from 9 a.m. to 5 p.m. Come shop and fulfill your grocery needs at Hilo Supermarket, where customers don't just shop, they save. The time by Hilo Food Stores making life easier is 4.45 p.m. Let's not be at a quarrel, it almost break my heart And I am so afraid that we will have to part Cause each night I hate the stars above Why must I be a teenager in love? One day I feel so happy, the next day I feel so sad I guess I've learned to take the good with the bad Cause each night I ask the stars above Why must I be a The sunshine day Sunshine day Sunshine day Sunshine day Girl, this morning I did your son again You make me better But you won't me again I'm 
when she bounce it in time. Oh, oh, oh. oh. Man have a right to, man have a right to If you don't hurt me, me never hurt you Man have a right to, man have a right to If you don't hurt me, me never hurt you Come lady, you want me sugar cup, don't Could I give you anything to me? Come out, come put your cheek on me If I try to give me money, but that Because you give your ass for the drum, drum, drum Pull up, sell up your eyes If you don't have drum, you come out your front Eat and listen, come back Put your body in, tie your feet in the sun, don't Hey, Pupasan, when you're ready, you feel come. Any time you link me, your DS so that done. They have a police cause of the belly of a king, son of mother. Don't go pick him and make him shoot, so don't go make you feel the tree, feel the step mark, no. As much as you want, that you would have tried here, don't. Oh, yeah, you think the police are the one that have done. You think I take a look and put the pan one. FM voice of Barrington, leave it on your radio. And I gotta tell you, he is also performing at Shaggy and Friends on Saturday, Jan- uh, January 6, 2018, on the lawns of Jamaica House. Other performers include Sting, Fetty Wap, Dougie Fresh, Shakadimas and Pliers, Christopher Martin, Idonia, Third World, Professor Nuts, Junior Reed, Bungie Garland, Capleton, Wayne Wonder, Fayon Lyons, Ding Dong, Shen Sia, Dexter Daps, and Shaggy himself. And of course, your Fluffy Diva will be hosting. So make sure you guys get your tickets. One ticket equals one life. And it's hashtag Team Shaggy for Kids. And this year, the target is for the ICU. And do remember, guys, all proceeds are in aid of the Boston Mighty Hospital for Children. And showtime starts promptly at 8 o'clock. So make sure you go get your tickets and be there early to have a great time for a wonderful cause. And uh, we're going to have a wonderful experience. Do remember uh, to visit uh, Shaggy and Friends uh, to see the traffic changes because we want to make sure uh, that we adhere to all the traffic uh, changes and all the logistics that they have worked out uh, for persons who are platinum ticket holders or gold ticket holders or silver ticket holders as to where your parking will be and from where you'll be shuttled and all of that information. It's all online so please avail yourselves uh, to the information so that we won't have any any kind of confusion. We won't have any uh, traffic snarl, any uh, backup or any kind of incident. We want an incident-free um, event. And so we're asking all persons to ensure uh, that you know where you're going, where you're parking, what's to be done and what's not to be done. Thanks, of course, to King Pliers for being here this afternoon. He's going to be on Shaggy and Friends as well. And it was definitely uh, very 
Wonderful having him here uh, this afternoon. A gentleman, uh, you know, that we've watched uh, Calico over the years. You know, he's in Pan TV and so on. Yeah, and, you know, it's great. really great uh, to have players in studio. Yeah. Looking forward to a wonderful show. And at the top of this hour, Nationwide at Five, the best news in the nation, led by Cliff Hughes, along with his hardworking team, will take you until 8 o'clock. Got to sign out right now so that DJ Calico can give you some more music. And do look out for... Uh, um, Pliers, his album is coming out in April, his birth month. Uh, so make sure uh, you look out for that, all right? Uh, thanks, of course, to my technical operator, Mr. Damian Cunningham. Thanks to my DJ, DJ Calico. Thanks to my assistant producers, Andrew Carrick and Martina Allen. My social media manager, Lethan Grandison. And my executive producer, Lady Tajna Williams. I love all of you for listening, and I love all of you for watching. Thanks for making it Miss Kitty Live. And on to when next to hear my voice, be blessed. Take care of yourselves and each other. And always remember, never forget, don't focus on no locus. Tomorrow, it's going to be a riot in here. I don't know how I'm going to manage. I don't, I don't really know. I don't know how you guys are going to manage. But we all have to just manage. You know what I mean? It's going to, it's going to be it's going to be rambunctious, <laughs> to say the least, uh, tomorrow. So make sure you guys tune in two to five, uh, 3 to 5 right here on Nationwide 90 FM. Thanks to my Facebook crew on Facebook.com slash The Fluffy Diva. And of course, you know, you can find me on Twitter and on Instagram at Fluffy Miss Kitty. F-L-U-F-F-Y-M-I-S-S-K-I I T T Y. Take care of yourselves, guys. Have a wonderful afternoon and a pleasant evening. And keep it locked right here to Team Revolution as we revolutionize how you listen to and love afternoon radio. My resistance is getting weaker. I can't stand the pressure. I can't get any weaker. I've got to find some other treasure. I need nothing to be a man. Because I was born a man. And I deserve a rise to it. Like any other man. Oh, my mind is such a state. Sometimes it makes me sick. Sometimes I try to eat, but I just don't know the trick. I need nothing to be a man, because I was born a man. And I deserve a life to live like any other man. Book back, book back, book back, book back, book back. Thank you for that respect. Hi, Sheldon. Today, guys, thank you for tuning in. And we're gonna be back tomorrow. So we, I love you too, pretty I go there no more. You too, Chile.
Oh, you too, Keisha. I thank you. Watch the end and know, yeah. Awesome. With him bad mind self. <laughs> my ignorance. Right up in the garden, silk. Huh? Oh, my God! Exit, you know what I mean? Like, oh my God, I hope he squeezes it in. Good job. Okay, guy. Books bad mind. Books is having a little bad mind. I'm telling you, right? That's what's happening right now. Big up to Stacey from Cayman. Thank you, guys. So it's time for me to go. Have a wonderful afternoon, a pleasant evening. Remember to like and share the video. And I'll catch you here tomorrow, 3 to 5, right here on Miss Kitty Live, God's willing. So make sure you're tuning in tomorrow. Me get a head band. Me get a head band. Beer nice. This is going to flare and flare and flare. Want to make sure to grease up with the shoulder, grease up with the body. Love it. <laughs> <laughs> I gotta tell you, be a nice sister tomorrow, guys. Catch you tomorrow right here. I want some grass my Jardine Eller. <laughs>